Hello guys, this is Vineet Burgis from Zara Securities, bringing you first of its kind ethical hacking video tutorial series. With this tutorial, you will be going through series of ethical hacking techniques, which will be scenario based and real in its nature. Hope you will find this enjoying and at the end you will find this very helpful for your security and ethical hacking career as well. So talking about what is ethical hacking, as the definition suggests, ethical hackers are the IT professionals who are skilled in securing computer systems by implementing security fixes against methods used by black hats or malicious hackers. So why to be an ethical hacker? Unlike black hat hackers, ethical hackers are appreciated from companies for finding and reporting security loopholes which we also call them bugs responsibility. This is known as bug bounties. Some bug bounties are also rewarding. Facebook, Google, Microsoft are major organizations who reward for finding security loopholes in their web applications and products. So being an ethical hacker is all about being a good guy. It's all about legality. Ethical hackers don't have to worry about get, you know, getting arrested by police or FBI getting involved. Ethical hackers conduct security assessments with authorization of the owner of the organization. Coming to the black hat. Black hats are the bad guys you know, who steal your money, your password, hijack your email accounts. Black hats are the people of the underground community who do cybercrime for financial gains and fun. Being a black hat is a crime. Under new IT act, cybercrime may end up a person with three years of serious imprisonment with 50,000 rupees fine. So choosing who you want to be is the next major question. A good guy or a bad guy? I'm leaving that up to you. So talking about ethical hacking as a career, ethical hacking is one of the booming IT industries right now. Last year itself, ethical hacking was estimated to be around 7.8 billion industry in US alone. According to India NASCOM, India will require around at least 1,45,000 ethical hackers every year, whereas India is only producing 15,000 a year currently. Ethical hacking is also one of the best lucrative jobs right now. So talking about the things which are be needed to be a successful ethical hacker. To be an excellent ethical hacker, you must have sound knowledge in programming, starting up languages like C, C++, Python would be excellent for starters like you. With programming, ethical hackers can create their own tools according to their comfort. You know, developing zero days would be necessary in future, which we shall be providing you in future video tutorials too. The next thing is understanding how operating system and computers work. So understanding operating systems and its core functionalities would give you a much better idea of how to exploit it. So working with Windows you know you must know how it works Linux would be much better for learning ethical hacking in future videos we will be using the same Linux as our attacking machine networking is yet another basic thing which is very much important to be an ethical hacker which which is very important You should be familiar with switches, routers and other networking devices as well. An ethical hacker must be good in networking and it will be giving him an idea of how computers can be exploited in a network. Protocols like TCP, ICMP, HTTP are used in networking. So knowing them and their functionalities would give you as an ethical hacker a much clearer vision of securing it. So this was all about an introduction to our ethical hacking video series. In the next tutorial we will be discussing about hacking methodologies and a few initial steps for starting it. By that time you can subscribe to our YouTube channel for future YouTube videos 
on this ethical hacking series. You can also send your suggestions on our mail too. Thank you, thank you for watching this video and stay tuned for future videos as well. Thank you.